The boy announces the product he is selling while a man sneakily steals them. He exchanges the loaves of bread for bags full of dirt so that the child doesn't realize that something was missing. After he takes them all he stops and eats one. What a tasty bread, then leaves. Hi auntie, I brought you some fresh bread, says the boy. Bread? Where is that bread? This is sand, says the woman. The boy does not understand. How come? It was bread, I made it myself this morning. You are just trying to trick me, aren't you? You are not old enough for these games no, no Andy, I'm not trying to fool you, I made it myself in the morning, I need to buy my grandmother's medicine, tell you what, you go home, make some more bread and when you come with the bread I'll buy it, but I can't buy, bags of dirt, Andy, but I don't have a mother, I only have my grandmother and she is very sick, tell you what, I have no money now, while you go to your house to bake the bread, it is time for me to go get the money to help you and I can't accept sand, I need the bread, go ahead and bake. I need money now to buy a medicine, I really want to help you, but go make the bread, he leaves. Children in their games, hey, these are my buns, shouts the boy when he sees the man eating the bread. There's nothing of yours here, kid, is your name on the bag by any chance, there is no name, but these buns are mine. It was you who exchanged my buns for bags of dirt, I want my money now, shouts the boy, go away boy, are you trying to fool someone with these bags of dirt here in the, square? I'm very rich, I'll open my own bakery. If you are so rich pay me that I need money, says the boy the man refuses and the little boy begs for the money and explains that he is going to buy his grandmother's medicine. The man doesn't care and tells the boy to get away from him. And another thing, I'm opening a bakery and after I open you're forbidden to sell bread around here, this, square is not used, I sell it whenever I want you don't tell me what to do the man rebels and tells the boy to get out of his sight, the child insults him and says that he will pay for this. The man taunts the child as she leaves. Grandma, how are you, asks the child. My son, I'm still in a lot of pain and how are you managing to buy my medicines? The very sad boy informs that he was, robbed by an evil man, his grandmother is very sad and says that the world is very wicked. What shall we do, grandma, we still have flour, you can bake some more bread and sell it today, says his grandmother. The grandson agrees and says he will do it. The child mixes all the ingredients carefully and finally puts some laxative in one part of the loaves to make the man pay for what he has, done. Again the child goes out announcing his sales when the man sees it, comes running and steals two loaves of bread. The child checks to see if he took the ones with laxative and is happy that he did. The man eats with gusto, what tasty bread, it tastes different today, but it's delicious. The man eats them all and begins to feel a discomfort in the stomach. The boy stops and goes to the man. Hey man? Did you like my bread? Says the boy smiling. What did you put here? Asks the man. I put a little present for you. Speak up. What did you put here? says the man feeling a discomfort in his stomach, by the way, I have some medicine here, do you want it, asks the boy, the man confirms and tries to take it, but the child pushes him away, no, not to get the medicine you'll have to, give me a thousand ria eyes, a thousand ria eyes, you want to rob me, says the man uncomfortably, will give me, no money, no medicine, if I were you I would buy it soon or your pants will soon get dirty the man begs for the medicine, the boy seeing that he won't pay says goodbye, but the man tells him to wait and says he will pay. 
the man takes an amount of money from his pocket and hands it to the boy, who keeps it and then hands over the medicine. I told you that you would pay me, says the boy smiling. Grandma, I managed to buy your medicine and besides the medicine I will be able to bake several breads for us. The very happy grandmother asks how he got the money, since they had stolen it earlier. Grandma, I did it my way, no one can steal from anyone because evil always comes, back to you. This is making me worried, tell it straight, mama what's done here is paid for right here, my son I'm so happy you helped me, says grandpa hugging him and telling him to be more careful and hugging him.